Hey guys, welcome to part seven of Guitaro Man. Uh, a shoe, a shoe. Uh, hmm? pi Pico? Like I said earlier, he starts seeing people that he knows from his life. What are you doing They're just here? in outer space. So like uh, Zoe well, and Kazuya, Pico and Kira. And, uh, Can you sit down there? Uh, uh, sure. So who is this Pico? Oh, just an old flame. <laughs> oh, you um, won, you sly devil, never you. Never? Oh, don't worry about it. I just came out for a walk to see the moon, but then I heard that. Oh, this, yeah, somehow I seem to be okay with this thing. Mm -hmm. You're good. I tried once, but I could never play like that. Alright, now this is one of my favorite levels in the entire game. I know I've said that a lot, but this one really is pretty awesome. And you know why? Because the entire goal of this level is to slay her heart. Seriously. Like, she has a health bar and everything. Just, just watch. Now would be a good time to grab your loved ones and cuddle with them, because this might be the most beautiful song ever written. Sorry about that. So you see your health bar going down this whole time? I mean, you're literally slaying her heart. It's not like you kill her and steal any kind of guitar from her at the end. It's like you're breaking down her defenses to sleep with you. Pretty much. So keep this in mind, fellas. Next time some strange pink-haired girl comes up to you when you're sitting on a beach somewhere, just pull out your guitar and just say, you know what, I got this. I'm gonna slay her heart. I haven't been saying much throughout this whole video, but I feel like I don't really have to say anything. I think this really just speaks for itself, really. It's just an adorable love song. It's a really genuine moment. And of course he has to peek and make sure, okay, is she actually asleep? Oh, yeah! I love that! It's like, yeah, you won! You're so getting laid right now! And I mean, does he get laid? I mean, we just kinda... Well, we skip to morning after that. The cutscene skips straight to morning, so you, you don't know whether or not he got a little something-something that night. Uh, more of this Japanese backdrop. These things repeat throughout, and they say some kind of mumbo-jumbo that I guess makes some kind of poetic sense when you put it all together. But, uh... Now Pico's gone. I mean, Kira is gone. Puma's gone. And Yuan and his sideburns are left all alone. And uh, that's really all I there is for this know, episode. Uh, check in next time. See you guys.